To customize the look and feel of each of your quizzes, simply go to the Customize and Review section of each of your quizzes that you have created. In here, you can change the font that is used in your quiz. And you're gonna always see a live preview of it right here to the right. So again, you can change the font right here to anything that you'd like. Um, we do have about 20 to 30 fonts in there. You can also change the color. So we could do something different there. Um, you can also type in any color code. So if you have very specific colors that you would like to use, something that maybe matches your brand, you can always type that in right here. You can type in the hex code. Uh, so let's say we wanna go black here. And again, this color is going to be throughout your quiz. So make sure you click and see what that's gonna look like on your actual question section. You can change the background color. That background color is going to be obviously the background right there with your questions. Um, so you can go ahead and change that just by adjusting it again. You can put in your hex code. If you wanna see what it looks like on the start page, just hit reset preview. You can also change the button color that you see. Again, you can put in your own hex code or you can just go ahead and select one by dragging and dropping. Uh, this option here, the cover image opacity sec setting, so that's going to bring forward whatever that background color is. So say you had a red, it would make it more red in the background. As you can see, that's adjusting as we're moving here. So it's something you can play around with. Now the next option that you have in here is the URL redirect. So this is important if you have your quiz embedded on your own URL or somewhere differently. And when somebody clicks that share on Facebook or share on Twitter button, it's going to share this URL and the headline and description that you give versus the one that comes standard with your Lead Quizzes account, which is just going to be this quiz.leadquizzes.com URL and then the quiz title and the quiz description right there. Once you have those set how you'd like, just click save and I'll go ahead and save it to your quiz. If you don't like the way they look, you can always restore to the default. Um, another thing you can customize in your quiz is the actual logo that you're using at the top of your quiz. To do that, go to the little gear here, click profile settings, and then upload your logo. You can also change the your website URL. So that is going to be when somebody clicks on your logo, it's going to take them to that URL. So there you have it, ways you can customize your quiz.